going on YouTube. <clears throat> so the world knows that it was an assassination attempt on President Trump maybe about an hour ago, hour and a half ago. And he has emerged safely. And um, the shooter was was killed. It's a lot of details that I've been hearing so far that I'm not going to, that I'm not going to discuss because I don't know how true any of these details are. Um, however, if President Trump was assassinated today, I'm not sure that I'm out here calm walking on this golf course. It's very, very scary times in the United States right now. And I just made a video about why I would never live in the United States again. And I didn't even say anything about the politics of what's going on. Like just the divide, just, you know, I mean, there's so much divide in the States and it's been like that, whether it's black and white, whether it's Democrat, Republican, um, whether it's Muslims and Jewish, like it's just so much, so much divide in this country. And that's one of our, that's one of our biggest problems. And the crazy thing is, um, what you've seen, no matter what, right? When whatever happened to Trump and whether he, whether that was a ricochet, he got shot. But one thing that's clear is that when the abrasion happened, his blood was red. So it doesn't matter if the same thing happens to me and the abrasion happens on my ear, what's going to come out of me is red. I just don't understand why we have so much divide in this country when we have such a great country. I just don't understand it. This is the place, this is the, a country where people are walking across the, um, the Darien Gap to get here for opportunity. As much as I say, look, I will never live in the United States again, like the opportunity that the United States affords us to be able to start a business, to be able to do YouTube, to be able to have free speech, just so many, so many different things. And the divide is just, it's killing our nation, it's killing the country. And no matter what, I can say how much I love Colombia, but I'm an American, I'm an American first. And I love being an American. Um, this is very, very scary times though, man. It's like, man, I have a, and I'm scared, I'm scared for my family. And as you should be too, because I'm telling you, I, I believe if Trump was assassinated today, it would be a civil war in this nation. And we were that close to having a civil war in this nation. And I have a, a mother, I have three daughters, I have three nieces, a, a nephew, a sister, a brother-in-law. And man, I love all of them. And this is it's just scary to, it's, it's scary that we are that close to something like a civil war. Like I would have never thought in my lifetime we would be here. Man, this is... I'm very happy and like... Just lost for words, man, honestly, honestly. This is, this is not good. See, I don't, I, you know, no matter whether I voted Trump or whether I voted Biden, no matter what, like, I don't wish that on anybody, you know? And it just, it shouldn't be like that. It shouldn't be like that.
stay safe, guys. Stay safe. And God willing, I'm glad Trump is all right. Praying for his family, praying for him. I'm praying for our country, man. Honestly, I'm praying for our country. This is wild. This is wild. People will stay safe out there and um, stay woke. <laughs> for real, stay woke. Everybody on the internet, you know, y'all ain't paying attention. Y'all think this shit is game. Y'all trying to get girls. Y'all want entertainment. Man, it's a lot of shit going on in this country right now, man. And we all need to be aware of what's going on. Real talk. Because it affects us and our families. And... If you ain't talking about that, then, or you ain't thinking about these things, then shit, you don't need to be watching my channel, for real. So, man, I'm praying for our country. I'm praying that we just stop being so divided, and which <laughs> that shit like probably ain't gonna never happen. We always gonna be divided, shit. It's so crazy, like in the olympic year too we all got to root for america <laughs> right how can you root? you know like man this is wild but i'm out man i just wanted to come on here and, and 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 say man this is a monumental day july 13th 2024 this day will go down in history seriously this is a monumental day attempted assassination on president trump today and um be safe out there guys this day goes on in history <laughs>